Legal. Okay, YouTube. Uh, pretty much, I've been knocking out these videos all day. I got a lot of new shoes here lately, like this last week. So I figured I would just do all these videos here. Uh, I had to leave out for a second, came back, and now I'm rocking on another video of a brand new pickup just got today. And another early release. Uh, these shoes, I had a pair. I had actually four pair. And I kept one pair, flipped the other three because they were a real hype shoe. Uh, but I wanted a pair for myself. Eventually, I ended up selling that pair and half of myself because I just kind of, for the moment, I got bored with them. So I sold them. I regretted it. I ain't gonna lie. So when I seen these, I was like, man, I got to have them again. Of course, a different colorway. But um, these come out this Saturday as well, along with the grapes. Uh, a little bit different from most of my other reviews, but here we have the Griffey. Um, I'm not sure if they even came out like a real, a real name for these. Uh, the Navy Volt. I'm guessing none of came out the ones that were like regular blue with the Volt colorway. This one has the Navy Blue. With the Vogue Green, of course. But, um, really, really, really dope shoe. I seen them in person. When I saw them on the picture, I was kind of like, ah, they're okay. When I saw them in person, though, I was like, man. And I just broke down. I was like, let me get them in the 10 and a half. And I just swiped the card. Left out. No questions asked. I didn't even want to think about what I had just done. But it's all good, though. Um, like I said, I, I would definitely not sell these. I haven't really been selling any of my stuff lately anyway. But I would definitely not sell these for sure. Because I already went through it once when I saw the first pair. Man, don't you when, you get, when you get a new pair of shoes and it got a little, like a little, it hadn't even been warm. It got like a little stain on there. Anyways, uh, sneakerhead problems. Anyway, but uh, as you can see here, very, that stain is going to irritate me. So I'm going to grab this one here. But um, like I said, these come out here this Saturday along with the grapes. Uh, definitely not as hyped as, as, the, as the grapes are for sure. But these probably will still sell out probably in about, I give it about a week, two weeks at the most. Um, but regarding the review, we'll just hop right into it. As you can see, like I was mentioning earlier, um, the navy boat, I guess you can call this particular pair. Um, the whole upper part is a navy nubuck. As you can see with the white leather accenting right in the middle and the black nubuck swoosh with the volt green stitching to accent it you do of course have the gray laces in here which definitely is a, is a nice touch there considering nothing else on the shoe is gray so it makes it pop a little bit more you have the strap as well I like to wear mine usually with the strap open but it does say Nike on there kind of indented along with the sides here, you have uh, some more indentions, just a little bit of accenting there, a little bit of adding some variety to the shoe. On the side here, number 24, uh, these are the Griffey Max 1s, King Griffey's number 24, along with the Volt Color Swoosh to go with it as well. On the back, you do have the Volt Nike Swoosh going upward. Uh, the inside of the swoosh is black, Volt trimming once again, and like I was mentioning earlier, the navy blue nubuck. You also have a pull tag on the back when you are pulling it up. This one, this is one of the glove fit shoes, so they fit very snug. I do suggest probably getting about a half size up, maybe if you are going to get them. Um, along the bottom, as you can see, uh, pretty much a white midsole does have black ac black accents along each one of the the Volt air bubbles it has. So wherever there's an air bubble, it has like the little the little black right above it. And in the front as well, the black sole comes up onto the toe portion. And underneath the bottom, you have the, the traditional pattern for the for the Griffey Max 1s. Vol accenting along the bottom as well. Oh, a little bit of gray on the, on the bottom here to go with the laces. And on the back, you have like a flame that comes into a baseball here as well with another gray swoosh. But uh, overall, a very nice shoe. Uh, I forgot to even mention, it has like um, one of the satin filling tongues, kind of the slick material. And you have another pull tag in the front here as well. 
with a gray swoosh on it and the mesh going up the uh, the center portion here as well on the inside it is all navy along with uh, the Volt color Nike Air as well but um, there's a little bit of a close-up look with it before I do show you a picture of them on feet as well alright YouTube here is the Griffy Max 1's Navy Volt on feet here um, as you can see real 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 nice uh, once you has the strap down once you have the strap up either way it goes still a fresh shoe this is feeling a little bit tight though at least on my ankle but uh, that's the look from the inside for you real nice there that's the look from the side on the one that with the strap and with no strap here but uh, like I was saying before uh, if you like the shoes to be a little bit loose I recommend getting about a half size up. This is a ten and a half right here. I usually wear about a ten, ten and a half. Uh, I could probably wear an eleven in these for sure, but I like my shoes to fit kind of tight. But that's just me personally. Here is a look from the from the back for you. The green bolt definitely sticking out there, and of course a look from the bottom. But like I was saying, real nice shoe, no matter what kind of way you rock it. This is the kind of shoes you want to rock more shorts, at least myself personally. Um, just because they don't have the really big tongue on these, so you can't really put your jeans behind them. Unless you're rocking like skinnies or something. So I prefer to rock mines with shorts on this particular style. But either way, it's going to be dope regardless. That is a look of the Griffey Max 1 on feet. Alright, so that was my review of the uh, the Navy Volt Griffey Max 1s. Um, like I said, these do release this Saturday, so keep on the lookout for them if you're a really big Griffey fan. Uh, really nice shoe overall. Um, it's not enough that I can say about it. Definitely, uh, definitely, definitely up there. Probably, definitely my favorite Griffey model. Probably most people's favorite Griffey model in general. Because like I was saying, they probably will sell out pretty quickly. Um, especially with, with them having more of a cool traditional colorway with it and not being anything too crazy. But um, last thing here, before I do let everyone go, I am doing a couple giveaways. First off, got a size large in some LeBron South Beach shorts. And I also have some Nike Elite red and white LeBron socks also. These are size large, fits a size 8 to 12, so right there in the middle. Um, if you're looking to win one of these items, let's see what I'm going to do. Um, let's say for the socks, let me think about it. So I thought about it, and I figured out what we're going to do uh, about the shorts and the socks. Um, everybody loves the Nike Elite socks. I never really got too much into it. I'm just more of a just regular black socks, but I got them anyway. Um, but free is free. The fifth person to actually follow and DM me on Twitter at the Real Chuck T, I will send y'all the socks. Like I said, it's a size eight to twelve, which will fit most sizes pretty much. And then the tenth person to direct message me saying they want. They want something for free. They get the pair of LeBron shorts, size large. Uh, $40 pair of shorts, pretty much $20 pair of socks. Plus, I'm sending them to you. So, free is free. Take advantage of it. I'm just giving away because, of course, I ain't going to really do much with it. I don't really do, do the colorful shorts. I don't really do the socks. But I got it anyway just because I think y'all will not be, be out shopping sometimes. You know. But either way I go, follow me on Twitter and Instagram at the real Chuck T, at the real Chuck T, at the real Chuck T. I said it three times. Make sure to follow me and subscribe uh, right down below. And thank you for watching once again. I will be doing another giveaway actually because I hit 100 subscribers on here. And I'm really happy about that. So I will be doing that giveaway sometime soon as well. 
haven't decided what I'm going to be giving away, but just make sure to stay tuned and uh, keep track. So that's what it is. But I will catch y'all next time. The sky's falling, the wind is calling, stand for something or die in the morning. Section 80, high power.